So here we go, game number two. Um, do I want to keep this? Do I want to keep this? Uh, it's got early DRT. Uh, Animution. Um, I could get worse, so I'll keep. Um, yes, I'll keep. Gnarl, gnarl, gnarl. So I'm gonna play DRT, Jax, and Fetal. That'll be my turn. I should have waited for him to see if he was keeping or not. I just want to make sure. Alright, so uh, let's go with. Why does he always have a parentheses at the end of every message? Interesting. Alright, so please know Maker's Eye Arena. Ah, oh, the keyhole. Uh, it's a keyhole? Okay. Alright, so I'm definitely gonna need to put uh, some defense there. But now he's gonna see most of that. So he threw out Gans. What are you giving me, Psychic Field? Okay. Uh, now, the thing is, do I reveal that I have a Jackson? Because the problem is he's gonna keyhole me non-stop. Uh, I think it's important. Now it's a race. Like, I need to start cheating. Oh. Woo! <laughs> I needed a Yurgo, and I got it. That was a little bit ridiculous. Get rejected. Alright, so he's gonna mute he's immune to any shenanigans in RD, which is a problem. down. It's okay, I don't think he'd be using that anyways. So I think my objective now is going to be dump all the Shikus in archives. Push an ocean. So I'm actually going to overdraw on purpose. Oh, and then I'm going to motion this running. Oh, no, I'm not. I need to overdraw. Overdrawn so that I can play a throw GQ. So now I can just pay to my storm. I'll motion the Ronin next turn. Um, and strength zero. So it doesn't really matter, uh, like I'm looking at cards in it, so it doesn't really matter if he... What am I trying to say? Holy shit, English is hard. What I'm trying to say is, um, it, like the first routine here, it's at least letting me filter one card. So there's that. But uh, yeah, this keyhole is gonna be relentless. Uh, fetal AI, yes, I'll send that to the bottom of my deck. Because the problem is that fetal AI needs to be hit, like. Fetal AI needs to be hit on the table for it to matter now, or in my hand. Oh, 
was gonna say, as long as he didn't get full out of him, okay. Uh, okay, so there's Fetal. Um, so I'm at six cards, if I go to seven, there's DRT. Uh, I'm gonna motion this Ronin. doesn't draw cards, he loses. Oh, okay, he's playing it safe. Just throwing Rona nose, okay. I do this. Okay, so Jackson Howard. Do I want to give him the chance to trash it? Probably not. So I'll send it to the bottom uh, so that it gets shuffled again when keyhole ends. He's about to run out of money, is what's going on. Oh, how many points is there in here? There is. One, two, three, four, five. There's five points with him, so that's brutal. So he's only got three more runs. Um, I'm gonna force him to take the minus one. We found another house tonight. Okay, there's six points worth in there. Oh man, this is brutal. This key holding. Oh no, that's my Jackson Howard. So if he finds a point here, I think he wins. Uh, no. This guy is chugging through my deck. Alright, so I got, what, six points waiting for him here? Right, look at this. I've got one, two, three, four, five, six points. Okay, so we're still okay. I was gonna say, our one hope is to draw like, a future perfect and then be able to motion notion it. Uh, okay, this is really good actually because now we have Shikyu in the discard pile. Keep drawing. Um, so I'm gonna throw out Shikyu. Uh, this is this is crazy. Shikyu and well, he's never gonna hit a snare, so. He's got one credit. And there's two sheet keys in there. The other thing you can do is okay, just there. Okay, that's good. So now he can actually get in. Okay, that's fine. 
the future perfect. Okay, so. So I chose to put it there, because it's going to get shuffled anyways. But if it ends up in the discard pile, um, uh oh, this is bad. Um, does he, I think he, no, he doesn't die to fetal first. I think he wins now. As long as he doesn't go full retard, I think he wins. Because if he runs, he'll take one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight points. I'm so confused. Okay, so now the question is... Oh! Well, the thing is, he can't actually... Okay, yeah, we gotta work out like the math as to how he would steal it. So he would choose to steal... Uh, Philotic first, one damage. And then... So that'll get him to six points, unless he also steals. Fetal AI at the same time, it's going to cost him two to steal it, so he needs two credits, as well as five cards. So now the question is, do I have enough Jacksons left? Oh man, I really shouldn't have revealed that first Jackson. As soon as the keyhole hit the table, it was a big risk to reveal the Jackson. Oh, and I think that was the biggest misplay of the game. So now basically I'm wondering, do I roan into him? So if I run on him, he's going to have to spend three clicks drawing. So which means he can get... Um, so he's got he's to take at least five minute damage to steal from him here. So I'm going to run on him and draw a card. And the Ronin is going to slow him down for another turn. So again, always draw first. And I'm going to throw out... So he sees it. Oh no! There's the diesel. That's a GG, I think. Yeah, I think. Maybe not. Oh, fuck me. It's Jackson Howard. That would have been the next card I should have drawn twice. Ah, uh, yes, I'll send it to the bottom later. So I'm sending it to the bottom so it dodges. It dodges him. So now I'm guaranteed to not lose Jackson Howard, is basically how this works. So I think this one mostly fell apart, because I guess Keyhole's a direct counter to this. Um, I've been focusing a lot on defending my archives. I wonder if, if I would have played a different game where I just started scoring things, would that have put them on edge, maybe? Up. Okay. Uh, okay, so Future Perfect. It's not really useful in this scenario, because it's, it's not going to get me... It's not gonna get me anywhere. If I... Okay, so he needs two credits, five cards. So I think my only hope is to draw like mad for Jackson. I think that's the only thing I can do. Does that make sense? Because he has a ton of points. If I score this, it means he'll be at four cards. On his turn, he's just gonna draw, take a credit, run archives, win the game. Or draw, draw archives, yeah, okay. So I'm gonna just draw like mad for Jackson. And yeah, pray for the Jackson. So you got 16 cards, one on 16 chance. 
Here we go, Jackson. No. No. So then, so now basically I lose because there's nothing I can do to um, to prevent him. So throw that out. Throw that out. Um, keep neural in case he messes up. I guess like I can't throw anything else out because it's an agenda. Uh, motion for a So he's just gonna click for K's. I'm so confused. You're only you know, I'll leave it there. So I think he thinks that he'll take the field damage, or I don't know. Because he could he could have just taken a credit or ran archives and won. Because he gets to choose the order in which they um, they resolve. Second field, so no, I'll leave it there. Please not Jackson Howard, please don't kill him. God, our Lord and Savior, Howard be thy name. Okay, so, now I'm going to play this face down, and, uh, alright, this is going to take some serious consideration here. Not that my music just die. Alright, so, how many points he's got here, or does he have access to? He's got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 points. So I can remove 5 points making it worth only three to run there. Okay, so I'm gonna motion out Future Perfect, because I feel like he's not gonna run it. All right, so we're good. We're basically good now, okay. Game salvaged. One issue I have is I kind of want to bring back my other Howard. This will be really awkward if he runs Future Perfect. <sighs> Begin the keyholing. See, like the issue is, I need to. I almost need to bring back the other Jackson Howard, or else I'm about to deck myself. So this puts a good case for uh, like Kumenu instead of Pup. I think I'll try that next. I mean, obviously, I, like I haven't drawn up yet, so it doesn't really matter, but... Oh god, he's gonna run it. He's gonna think it's Junebug. Please don't run it! Please have mercy! Appropriate song for this moment. Eyes in the dark. Thanks, Shadow Run. Why would he do that? Oh my god. Oh, if that would have been an overrider, that would have been a good game. Uh, okay, so this is still bad, but... I guess what I should have done is put the, um... Um, the fetal out instead. Uh, I don't stuff stuff call. All right, so basically, I'm gonna lose to milling very soon uh, if I don't start scoring things. Um, in fact, 
we take a look at our deck here. I'm going to assume that I don't actually have enough agendas left in this deck to score. I have three House of Knives. Okay. Um, I need to advance this field three times, I think. Yeah, I should have Mushin the uh, Fetal AI instead. Uh, throwing Future Perfect out is really brutal. Bad boys. Lose the keyhole. Alright, so actually let's count them. One, two, three, four, five, six. Do 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 seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. So there's actually none left in RD. So the only thing that's ruining me actually is how he's pinging me um, from my cards. So, start a clock, I lose two cards on his turn and one card on mine, so I have like four turns before I lose the game. A bit more if you count um, Jackson. So I have four turns to score the shittiest agendas known to man. He's gonna take like three Shikus when he runs the archives. Man, this is brutal. Ugh, so he tries my run, okay. Alright, draw a psychic field. Um So advance advance score this, but what do I do with my last click? Do I play Psychic Field or do I play Gihan's Arcology? Key hands will let me get Key hands will let me get to God, this is difficult. Alright, I'm gonna advance my hands. Um okay now what do I wanna do with my last? Game though. Okay. Um, Archive memories. Um, he's gonna mill it if I don't put it at the bottom. Yes. 
So now, if I draw Archive Memories, I can bring back Jackson Howard and then throw down Psychic Field Jackson Howard, and I've bought myself like a turn and a half, maybe? I don't know. Come on, Archive Memories! Oof, diversified portfolio, useless. Okay. Um. Need to sneak this future perfect. So hopefully he thinks I'm faking and then goes for the psychic field. I think I, I think I have to bring back. Uh, I can't though because I have like at least four points worth in here, right? There's three house and eyes, and I, okay, yeah. I was gonna say I have to bring back a Jackson Howard. if he runs archives. So he still has to pay two to steal it. Okay. Diversified, not what I'm looking for right now. So now I'm gonna pop this one, and hopefully that makes him panic. Oof, okay, what, how can I, how can I make this work? I have to score these two agendas, but I can't score the future perfect, that's a problem. And he's basically going to see me do it, where I, I'm going to bring back Philotic. So he's at five points. I, I don't think I can. I don't think I can win. He's at five, right? Yeah. So my big misplay was that. I think he wins now. Alright, so the most, uh, well, the problem is, yeah, there's four, okay, so I'm gonna make Fetal, because that's two points, and we make Philotic Entanglement, then, uh, well, I don't think it actually matters how nice. So I just dug out five points.
So, yeah, there's two Shikus in here, maybe three, two. Yeah, two Shikus. And so, it's it's a little weird that, I mean, I guess because he's the runner, so he gets to choose which ones he wants to access first. But, I mean, it basically means that Shikus on match point are useless. I can see the game. Yeah, so big. I guess the biggest um, play mistake was that I uh, I used the first Jackson when I really didn't need to. How do I concede game? Um, yeah, I'll concede this game. Alright, so there you have it. That's how you beat this deck. You run Keyhole, apparently. Uh, again, I think biggest mistake was definitely um, revealing Jackson Howard. And I guess probably when I saw that he was going full Keyhole non-stop. Give me a second. Uh, okay, so he just quit. Okay, so yeah, um, let me just report the score here real quick for him. Oh, it's the spectator who left, okay. Um. Alright, so that's reported. Yeah, so I shouldn't have revealed the Jackson because he's running Keyhole. And I should have uh, scored, I guess, the Future Perfect more aggressively. I think when I. Did I motion it or did I just advance it three times? Um, I think I motioned it, and uh, although I, I always feel terrible when I do that, I think it was the right move because if he hadn't guessed properly, he would have basically. He would have lost the game. Uh, oh no, he wouldn't have. I'd still only be at 6. Uh, but I guess it would have forced him to shift his focus from keyholing non-stop every turn into, uh, into actually dealing with my, my servers. Oh, I didn't realize my rating was higher than this guy? No, I don't think so. Oh, I think my rating actually shot up. Check here, boom, boom, boom. Oh yeah, it's because my two matches from today haven't been filled in. So, yeah, I guess it'll eventually, <laughs> it'll eventually go in. Yeah, okay, so yeah, let's go over to one last time. So don't reveal your Jacksons against a keyhole, that makes a lot of sense. And then finally, uh, if someone commits really hard to keyholing, you have to make them... I, I failed to make them pay attention to the remotes. Um, let's see, what did I have left? I look at all my cards here. Oh, did I miscalculate? There was another fetal in there. Oh no, I just put him in. I just put it in. How do I... Match activity? How do I verify? Oh, so that's like he actually got more rating out of this than I did. Oh, 
Oh, there, buddy, looking at my my stack. That's a bit. It's uh, a bit rude. <laughs> I guess. How do I look at his stack? How do I do this? How do I? I'll just casually take a look at your stack then. What's he running? He's playing Underworld Contacts. Interesting. Magnum Opus, Desperado. Net, net Shield. He should have popped his Net Shield. Alright. Alright, well, there you have it. The shell game finally loses. I'm glad to see a strategy that can actually get through to it. Um, Keyhole is really interesting. I haven't seen it played in a long time, and uh, it's good to see it. Alright, so he's jumped out, and so finally, the last thing I want to say is um, I've been playing these two decks that I have for a bit now. And so if you guys have any suggestions or ideas or decks you want me to try to refine or just flat out just play in the league for fun, let me know and uh, I can look them over and give them a shot. GG!